who wants to know about supernatural sleep? And before you turn off, because there are so many videos, books, um, self-help things out there about how to get the best sleep, it's probably really boring. But this is a new perspective. I'm Dr. Leone Morris, energy medicine practitioner and energy psychologist. And sleep used to be so hard for me to achieve. I worked in a corporate blue chip, uh, not nine to five, more like 6 a.m. till 8 or 9 p.m., long hours, often seven days a week, traveling the world, um, shifting my body clock. And always when I went to bed, I found that I couldn't switch off. I had so many thoughts going around. My energy was sniffing everywhere. I didn't feel grounded, centered or calm. And I struggled to let go of the day. So here is a mixture of ancient wisdom and modern 21st century cutting edge science. The quantum energy way to soothe your energy patterns, to bring you back to balance and cohesion to guide you back home so that you can get the best night's sleep you've ever had. And not many people know this, but when you sleep um, and your energy is not grounded, when you're up in your head and those thoughts are swirling, well, obviously it's not very restorative. And actually the time you go to sleep um, makes a big difference on how well your body is regenerating. So I shared some facts that you can read up later um, in the attached post. But suffice to say, if you go to bed um, from 9 p.m. and get some good sleep from 9 to 11, that's when your body at a cellular level is regenerating, when new cell growth is being stimulated. If you don't get that, your body is literally not reproducing itself so easily so quickly and you're more likely to fall into ill health emotional disturbance and disease and then between 11 p.m and 3 a.m that's when your body is being nourished that's when you need to be in your deepest sleep uninterrupted sleep REM sleep when you fall into the the slowest um, brainwave output and that's what we want you to have and that's my gift to you today. So this is energy gift. I think we're on number seven, the gift of supernatural sleep. So first of all, you need to let go of your day. I'm going to start us off by setting an intention for calm and for sleep. So I'll start us down at our pubic bone here and just guide your hand slowly up to our bottom lip. I am setting the intention for calm, for uninterrupted, deep and nourishing sleep. And so be it. Once we've set our intention, actually speaking it out loud is the bridge between our conscious and our subconscious or unconscious mind. So speaking it out is actually putting it energetically into the energy surrounding us. And once it's there, it's a guide and a support for the energy patterns surrounding your body. We set our intention. Now I want us to clear the debris from the day that we've had. And we can literally do that. We're just going to rub our beautiful electromagnetic hands and get rid of that debris from the chakras, from the, the energy openings in our hands. Rub them up for some warmth. And just put them, the heel of your hand to your cheekbones, over your eyes. And this is a wonderful way to de-stress, to stop the energy circulating around your head, to stop thoughts from spiraling. It's about letting a go, about releasing your day. You can take two or three deep breaths here in through your nose. Ah, out through your mouth. Ah, and I would say this is about being conscious of your breath. Ah, softening your belly. 
and opening your heart. And you can stay in that wonderful position for as long as you like. You can even lie down and do that in bed. But I'm also going to take away any stress-related response from the day. My dog is joining me, so that's Charlie, if anyone's interested. I'm going to ask you to put your hands over your eyes. Take a deep breath and drag them to your temples. Another deep breath and then smooth it over your ears and round in a semicircle on both sides and dragging it down all the way to your shoulders and on another in breath dragging it down to your heart space and just with that simple breathing over your eyes over your ears, clasping your shoulders. You're inviting the stress and the tension to leave your body. And just crossing the energies over your heart, inviting calm. Now, if you've got some oil, I should have said this up front, but um, you don't need it necessarily. But a wonderful way to relax is to um, enrich the energetic atmosphere with essential oils. And these are a high vibrational energy tool that invite your energy to come into calm skin. But what we're going to do is to invite grounding is come down to our feet. Um, and our feet have wonderful energy points that go up the the bones between the toes. So if you, if you follow and trace up between every toe, you'll feel the bones that separate and support your toes. And we're literally going to massage up those spaces. Breathing as you do so. And of course you can do that on both feet using those lovely oils. And I'd also invite you to pull each toe just grab each toe give it a twist and a stretch especially over the knuckles any sensitivity is a sign of blocked energy stopping you from naturally grounding so for the best sleep ever if you get rid of this energetic debris on both feet that both feet doesn't need to take too long just massaging up those bones traveling up towards the ankle from the inside of your foot and i always like to do a lovely firm massage and any sensitivity don't hurt yourself any pain in energy medicine isn't helpful but any sensitive points just work those until you feel the tension release the same as on the other foot i'm gonna grab my big toe and twist it at the knuckles and then off throwing away that detritus energy that you don't need because when your feet are released you will be able to relax come to your calm center and ground so much more easily so now we have beautifully relaxed feet and you probably found that the energy as you're doing that your energy goes where your consciousness goes and it will have shifted down deeper into your energetic system. And the energy moves of literally opening the gates of your feet mean that we are connecting to Mother Earth. We are naturally coming home to a space where we can feel relaxed and enjoy an uninterrupted sleep. So after we've done that clearing exercise, so placing a hand here, and I always like to do it by putting my thumb behind my ear, because that's also naturally calming points behind the ear and up to our temple. So if you lie on your side or lie on your back, and you can do this both sides, whatever feels comfortable for you. And then following the line um, underneath your pectorals or your uh, breasts, under and put your arm, your hand underneath your armpit, but you know, on a on a level with a bra line if you were wearing a bra. This is the spleen, um, the end of your spleen meridian. And that's inviting negativity to release. 
sending calm signals to your energetic body. So this is inviting natural sleep. And if you tuck your head in, giving your backbone some extra space for the energy to flow, it's taking you deeper into your energetic core, calming the stress response, inviting negativity to be released. And you can enhance your ability to sleep now by focusing consciously on your breath. And there's a particular pattern of breathing called the, sorry, the four, seven, eight. Four breaths in, so count, for, um, count to four and breathe in. And then hold it. And with the same speed of counting, whatever makes sense to you, count to seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then breathe out for a count of eight. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And the idea is that as you are calling your as you are calling your energies for calm, as you are focusing on your breathing, your mind is emptying of thought, and your longer out breath. And the slower cycle of breathing is encouraging oxygen to flow more easily in your body, slowing down your heart rate, slowing down your brain waves, and inviting sleep to come. So don't force it, put no effort into this, just gently follow a breathing cycle. And if counting is distracting for you, just imagine um you know breathing in holding it and then for a much longer period double the period of your in breath breathe out slowly and you will find that sleep comes and you will get to your restorative deep alpha waves deep delta waves to have that nourishing regenerating healing sleep it is the best beauty gift the best health gift and the best gift to connect you to your wisdom and your energy the following day i hope you enjoyed my energy gift for christmas number seven and please subscribe share this with your friends i'd love more people to join me more people to lift their energy consciousness so thank you so much for sharing and thank you for watching Season's greetings.